Summer is here, but getting a tattoo in the summer can cause some problems. So in this video, I'm going to talk about getting a tattoo in the summer and how to protect your tattoo from the sun so it doesn't fade. So stick around. But if this is your first time here, my name's Mike. This is Manly Man TV. On this channel, I do weekly men's lifestyle videos and tattoo videos just like this. So if that's the kind of stuff you're looking for, consider subscribing. Don't forget to hit the bell notification just so you don't miss a thing. Summer is one of the most popular times of the year for people to want to get tattoos. The reason for this is because in the summer, you're not really wearing that many layers and clothing and your tattoo will be more noticeable. But there are so many risks of getting a tattoo in the summer that you really have to be careful. But what are those risks? Well, for one, if you plan on being outside a lot this summer with your new tattoo, you're gonna wanna cover it up. A fresh tattoo is super sensitive to the sun and can have a UV reaction slash burn that can not only cause problems to the healing process of your tattoo, it could cause problems to your health as well. So with that first week or so of you getting your new tattoo, Make sure you try to keep it out of the sun as much as possible. Whenever I get a new tattoo, I probably look like a complete idiot when walking around because I'm like walking around with like my arm covered and trying to keep it in the shade. So let me ask you a question. Do you plan on going to a pool or beach this summer? Well, then I wouldn't really recommend doing that with a fresh tattoo. You never want to fully submerge a tattoo in water until it's fully healed. That could take around four weeks. There is a huge difference between taking a shower and getting your tattoo a little wet to fully submerging the tattoo. While your tattoo is healing, make sure you stay away from oceans, lakes, pools, anything that might have harsh chemicals or chlorine in it because this could be painful and damaging to your new tattoo. So just wait till it's fully healed. Plan around it and give your tattoo enough time to heal so not only you can enjoy your new tattoo, but you could also enjoy your summer activities. Okay, so let's say your tattoo is fully healed and you don't really have to worry about any of the things that I was talking about earlier with a new tattoo. Well, no matter how old your tattoo is, this doesn't mean that you're out of the woods. As long as you have a tattoo, I'm sure that you want it to always look as awesome as it could be. So you need to protect it from the sun. Whenever I know that I'm going outside in the sun and that is pretty often because I work outside, I will apply a moisturizing sunblock just to make sure my tattoo is protected. And since it's a moisturizer, it will continue to make my tattoo look Look bright and awesome. This summer I decided to pick up a Hawaiian Tropical Silk Hydration Sunblock. It's 30 SPF, so it will protect your tattoos. And like I said, it's a moisturizer, so it'll make your tattoos look awesome. And if you're interested, I'll leave a link in the description down below to where you could pick this up because it is extremely important to keep your tattoos protected from the sun. On top of applying the sunblock to your tattoo, another thing that I would recommend is wearing a light layer of clothing over your tattoo. This will help prevent long-term exposure from the sun to your tattoo. But remember, it is summer, so if you don't wanna be wearing a long sleeve shirt or something like that, the sunscreen will work just fine. Remember, the sun will fade tattoos, so protect them. You spent all this money on your tattoo, you wanna make sure it's protected. And if you wanna learn more about tattoos, you could click right here. And if you found this video helpful, make sure to subscribe, and don't forget to hit the bell notification just so you don't miss future videos. And I'll see you in the next video. Peace, enjoy summer.